family of Brianna Taylor gathered with hundreds of people from the community today in downtown Grand Rapids holding a memorial service to honor her memory. Our Zach Herrig takes us there. Hundreds of people stood together in solidarity in Rosa Park Circle this afternoon to remember Brianna Taylor and continue the fight for change. Several of her family members also were in attendance to make sure that her memory lives on. It's always beautiful to see Grand Rapids show up every day. Justice for Black Lives stood with family of Brianna Taylor on Saturday afternoon to share memories about her life while also calling for change. Because we need our memory to forever be out here. We need people to always remember that she was killed in her sleep when she should not have been, and it could be any one of us. And we need to stay vigilant and we need to stay active. Taylor grew up in Grand Rapids and now more than four months since her tragic death in Louisville, Kentucky, her family continues to call for accountability from the officers involved. Say her name! We don't want our name to die. We want to keep this kind of attention so that those officers are accountable for their behaviors. The three hour event was very peaceful. Taylor's cousin, Tawana Gordon, says that's exactly what their family is all about. We can fight racism and injustice by being peaceful. We need to teach those that have, are of hatred that we can conquer change with love. We don't have to become violent. Taylor's family wants everyone to know the kind of person she was as they continue to spread a message of peaceful change. Brianna was a light in our family. This reform, and I know that she's proud because she, if she were alive, she'd be here today for someone else. Reporting from Grand Rapids, Zach Herrick, Fox 17 News.